Hi guys, it's Rhonda here to do another pour for you today. We're going to start off um, with the octopus and we're going to put his eyes in. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to wipe the majority of that off because I don't want all that. I'm going to dab his eyes. I'll make it a little little dribble. Okay. I'm going to lay that up there. And we're going to put his eyes in today. If I can get it to unstick from my glove and get it turned the right direction. Well, I guess I should have showed you our eyes today are going to be blue. And now I'm going to do the same with this one. I'm making a heck of a mess. My gloves here. I'll put this one in. Let me see. Do I have a pair of tweezers over here? No, but I got a popsicle stick that I can use to try to get his eyes in where they need to be. I put a line on the back of them so they're facing the right direction and not all slanted. But anyway, we're gonna let that harden and we'll do the octopus itself tomorrow. All right, guys, we'll be back after this is all ready to go. Hi guys, it's Rhonda here to do another pour for you today. We're doing some more resin. I had a request for an octopus with a orange head, which we're using Let's Resin Keller's uh, alcohol ink. We've got orange, purple body, peach red tentacles, with blue tips. So those are our colors today. And we're using the epoxy store, or the, yeah, the epoxy resin stores platinum clear resin today. And we're gonna go ahead and start pouring this in. And I mixed up 10 ounces of resin. Make sure we get all these tips. We went over that a little bit. All right. Leave a little bit of room for our alcohol inks. Get a baby wipe here. All right, let's start dropping our inks. Let's see. That wasn't very good. Stuck my hand right in it.
Okay, I might as well just leave the lids off because I'm going to be going through again. And then we got the purple, uh, peach red, which is our pink in this instance. more blue in that corner. Okay. Oh, what am I putting that lid on for? Okay, I wanted some more blue here. I think I need another dribble here. Definitely up here and here. I don't want the white spots. All right, let's go in here with some purple. the orange. Okay. And then this is the Let's Resin Sinker White C. We're going to use that next. Come back through with our colors. Getting some purple going on here. Peach, sorry, it's the peach red. body. Oh, put that 
back. The head. Let's come back in. Come back in with the white again. I hope I don't have my head in the camera. That wouldn't be good. Put some extra white in here his chest. Alright. I'm going and stuck my glove in it again. Make it a clean one. A clean tool. So I think I want to go in there with some more color the orange and the purple for sure because that's a lot deeper. on. Well, my gloves are the same color. I can't see it. Well, maybe it goes the other way. Yep, it does. That would explain why we couldn't get it. Alright, guys. Whenever you use alcohol inks, you do not I repeat, do not want to use um, a torch, or if you do, be very careful. So I will let this sit for a few and use my heat gun on it. We'll be back when it's time to demold it. guys she's all dry and hard and ready to come out of its mold so let's go ahead and see what we got here I hope the client that this is for likes it see what we got. Ooh, definitely different. Definitely different. I like it. I'll bring you up close so you can see. I love the blue eyes. The blue tips of the tentacles. Not so sure about the head here. We got a little bit of pretty heavy 
ink there. But that's what we got. So we'll send a picture and see if she likes it and uh, go from there. All right, guys, please leave me a comment. Tell me what you think. If you haven't already done so, please give me a like and a subscribe. And I'll see you on the next video. Bye.